my name's Rebecca, and uh, today I'm going to do something that I've never done before. And before I do it, I want to say I am so sorry to all the Latinos, everyone who speaks and understands Spanish. I have been studying and trying to understand Spanish off and on because I never believed that I could do it, like think in Spanish. I understand it. I can read it. I can write it. I watch it in um, documentaries, documentos. But right now I'm going to go ahead and speak it for the first time on camera. I didn't write a script or anything like that. So, hey, lo siento mucho para mi español mal, para mi mal español. Esta es mi primera vez. Uh, yo voy a hablar español en front de la cámara. Yo estudio español yeah, en mi casa con libros y yo hablo en las, en la, las calles. Yeah, in las calles, yo vivo in Miami. Sí, mucha gente so hablan español solamente. Y ahora me gusta un trabajo por aquí. Yo necesito, no, necesito hablar correcta y con confianza. No es fácil. Yo siempre pienso, no, no, yo nunca creo que yo puedo pensar en español y también hablar correcto. Ay, 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 I'm so sorry. The reason I'm doing this is I want to get a job. And down here in Miami, Fort Lauderdale, it used to be Spanish a plus. And now it's Spanish is necessary. Spanish is necessary and English is a plus. So if I'm ever going to get a good job, I have to get confident. And the one thing I've not wanted to do, I've used apps, I've used books, I've talked to people. I talked to people in the street in Espanol. I've always said, es Rebecca Espanol, lo siento. <laughs> Todo lo siento, lo siento. But I never, I never wanted to really dig into the grammar, into the grammar. You know, I understand it. I understand English grammar, nouns, verbs, adjectives, and all that stuff, you know, conjugations. But I really do believe that without the learning and studying with the grammar and actually sitting down and doing it the right way, I am never going to get to the point where I want to be, where I need to be. Because I would love to have a cushy little office job and just be able to talk Spanish all day long. <laughs> Hola, como estas? This is my first video and I'm going to dedicate the next, well, to my birthday, just like with the exercise. I'm put this on camera and as I become more comfortable, I will make much better videos in Spanish. I promise. And I also understand a little German. I understand Portuguese, Italian, Dutch, hello Dutch, Netherlands, and uh, French. So I have some time on my hands before I decide where I want to go work or what I want to do. So I'm going to be exercising and studying grammar. Uh, I think it's very important. I've helped people many times trying to learn English and they knew more grammar than me. They were like, oh, well, where do we put the preposition and how does this follow that? And I'm just like, what? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but that is something I'm going to work on. And... Uh, Presenting myself in Spanish because there's a lot of there's a lot of tutor jobs online for people who are like from the United States and they know how to speak and they know exactly the grammatical ways, what the correct grammatical structure of a sentence. So this was much harder than being on camera. Oh, and my daughter said, no more being on camera right after I work out because I look like crap. So, you know what, I don't look that much better now, but at least I'm not beat red and people aren't ready to call 911.
Anyway, tenga buen día. Bye bye. Adiós. Hasta luego.